So Cheryl, just tell us what it's like being a new councillor. Hello, my name is Cheryl Brooks. Um, I'm very proud to have been voted in as the first Green Councillor in Abingdon Town elections and the first Green Councillor in the Valley of White Horse elections. Um, it's very exciting, obviously everything's new. Um, I've also been made Deputy Mayor of Abingdon on Thames, uh, so that's exciting. Obviously the first Green that's been a Deputy Mayor of, um, of Abingdon Town. Um, at the moment I'm kind of getting into grips with what my job actually is and what I'm doing and how the council works. Uh, you get a lot of support actually. Um, I've been getting support from town clerks and people that work for this county. So, so that's good. So if anyone actually is considering standing, it's not that scary, even though I've only been to a couple of um, town council meetings, um, as you get a lot of help, a lot of support. So I would recommend that anybody stood. And if you're going to stand, I would also recommend that you don't leave it to the last minute to campaign, but do what the National Party suggests, which is target to win. So you're basically campaigning for at least a year in advance. Uh, that played a really big part in me winning. Um, right, so it's onwards from now on. Oh, just another thought. Uh, one of the first things that I'm getting involved in, uh, being a town councillor, is um, having the rainbow flag flying in Abingdon Town and Abingdon having a uh, pride event. Um, which is going to be for the council. So we're officially voting for it on Tuesday, but it looks like it's definitely going ahead. Uh, people of Abingdon probably know that the Tory council voted it down and definitely didn't flag during Oxford Pride. So I'm really pleased that that's one of my first things that I'm, that I'm pushing through. Right, thank you very much.